Okay, here we go. We're looking for this guy right here. And we're waiting for the mob. Okay, right here. Okay. All right. I got to get back to the kitchen. I'm preparing my uh, afternoon uh, dinner.
Green had our frequencies continue. This is a full scale attack while preparing my afternoon dinner. You can hear me in the kitchen. This is how victims are preconditioned at home to react. Green high level frequencies and constantly shocking their brain. Organized crime family is responding. Murder plot continues. Over time exposure, cause of death, tumor, cancer, other brain. Where that harassment again? Organized crime family is responding. The guy is still there. Ah, that's the uh, the the candy man, right here. That's it, and he's going up the stairs. That's the candy man, right there. And he gave the look. You saw him. Go look at that. He got a special package too. That's quick moving. That's quick moving. They're not wasting no time. They do not want to be exposed, but it's a little too late for that. That's the reason I was being harassed in the in the kitchen while preparing my uh, afternoon dinner. Uh, you can hear. The dog's barking on command signal uh, next door. Uh, 5135. Uh, homeowner Martinez right here. Now the dog stopped barking. See? That's how you catch people when they're up to something. A dog stops barking. Why? A dog starts barking and then stops barking very quickly. Obviously, somebody is coercing the poor animal to bark and stop barking. This is how they're able to manipulate their victims to react at home. And the only reason uh, homeowner Martinez, um, wife, daughter, son, daughter-in-law, are provoking uh, the dog to bark is to uh, manipulate me to... Uh, Record back there. Uh, you saw the sign that they have back there. That sign is to manipulate me to continue recording up there instead of focusing where the money's at right here. 5130 and 5132. That's where the revenue's at. And that's where the candy man's at. So we're going to keep our eyes on the prize. Uh, we're still waiting for the bag man. And we'll see what happens. It's... um. 4.39 p.m. June 25th, 2024, Tuesday. And uh, we're going to keep our eyes on the prize, of course. Uh, he's just sitting there. Obviously, who knows? But uh, I, I want to see if I can get the bag, man, if that's uh, possible. And I want to see if the mule guy, the other partner, is coming back. So we just uh, focusing on both at the same time. Yeah, I was in the kitchen, like I said, and I was being attacked. I said, why are they shocking my brain? Why the extreme frequencies? Why the bright light harassment? 
why the dog's barking next door and stopped once I started talking about the dog. They got caught. They got caught with their hand in the cookie jar. That's right, folks. High Tech Surveillance Monitor, very aware of my location and activities. Murder plot continues. Yeah, that's right. He's going back in. He was instructed to go back in. That's called peek a -boo. peek a -boo. Uh, You see somebody, and then you don't see him again. That's called peek a -boo. It's part of a distraction technique or um, trying to... Uh, Make me think that he's going to go back to sleep. Yeah, right. This guy doesn't sleep, and the other guy doesn't sleep either. These guys are mules. They're working constantly around the clock, distributing the white powdered bag product. That's their job. So right now, we are waiting for the bag man, and we're waiting to see what else we see. All right, this is going to go on to another video. I appreciate your support, and um, I hope you guys are staying cool. Uh, take care of your animals, and I, I appreciate your support.